Start that stream in three, two, one, bang. Yay, we're live. We're live. And we're jive. Blue, blue. Cool. Oops. <laughs> now I have to watch an ad for Bud Light. Sounds dope. <laughs> Last time it was fucking. I don't even know. Splatoon. <laughs> Has anyone played that? Sp played that game Splatoon? We had to play that on this. On this down. Mm -mm. Fun with it, boy. Playing around with all these these gosh dang scenes. Nice and nice. <laughs> I've gamed on a laptop before. I've gamed for fucking years on a laptop. It is painful. It's not fun. What's up, Koala312? What's up, Plodski? Welcome back. <laughs> oh, goodness. Really? Hmm. Can you guys hear me? Uh, let me see here. Here, let's try this. There we go. How's that? Say something? Something, something. Yeah. What's up, Ludi20? What's up, Opinion? -y? Um, anyway, for all the folks on YouTube, there is a link in the description to follow and go on over to the Twitch. We're going to play some PUBG because PUBG is fun. <laughs> fun. It's quote fun. Static Beats, I'm doing good, buddy. How you doing? Can everyone hear everyone? Everyone, uh... Uh-oh. Shut up. Oh my goodness. That sucks. Hang on a second. Hang on a gosh dang cotton picking second. Let me wrap it. I guess let me just remove that then. Technical difficulty, sorry guys. Amy can hear me apparently. <laughs> Say something. Can everyone hear Amy? <laughs> it's so important to me that you hear Amy. <laughs> Are we good? Are we fucking good? Are they just trolling me? Are they? Are you guys trolling me? Oh, okay, they can hear me, but not you, apparently. Fuck, dude. Fact, dude. We broke this shit. 
Why is OBS doing this to me? Oh, good God. Get the fuck out of here, fly. It's my settings. Audio, please. So device. agree wholeheartedly how about that can everyone can everyone hear amy, amy say some shit amy say some fucking yeah, shit talking shit can people hear me talking shit say some fucking shit please <laughs> fucking shit oh my god there, there we, we go, go. <sighs> anyway a good um introduction to me <laughs> just swearing at you all. Cool. On the video, it's just going to be like for the first like five or so minutes, it's just going to be us fucking around with the settings. Yep. We're good. All right. Cool. <laughs> cool. So, we're so gonna play um, FPP? yeah, let's play some fucking first person because people have been, people have been thirsty for it. Cool. Here we go. Girls on the web don't exist. It's a trap. So, yeah, that's what they mean by trap when they say trap. Yeah. I mean, I can't help it. She can't help it, guys. She's fucking Bailey J. What's her name? Yeah, that was. I think that was what people were saying. You can see my own eyeballs and mouth. It's yeah. terrifying. Ugh. Actually, hang on. This mode just annoys me. I'm just going to... Where are you? I'm going to punch Fuck you. Fuck out of here. Eh. Eh. Hey, hold still, hold still. Eh. Let me see your character's face. No. Oh, your learn... girl has really cute freckles. I want to punch them. You have cute freckles. <laughs> I'm cr crouch punching your, your tit box. <laughs> <laughs> my tit box? Yeah. Tit box. Yeah, I can see my, my own feet. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm wearing, like, the coolest boots. I like your cute boots. Oh my god, I love your cute shaped head. I'm actually 11, Where? so. It was really laggy for some reason. Where are we gonna go today? The stream is really fucking laggy, I have no idea why. I'm close Spotify, close Discord. <laughs> oh god, where are we going? Um. We can go... So, Dancing Grat says school. We should go to the school. And is that how we... asking on YouTube, yes, we do play CS because we're trash. We do. Actually, we're not <laughs> going to go to the school this round. We're actually going to go right here. So, three, two, one, bang. What's over here that you want to see? Um, uh, well... Besides you naked? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Ooh, what you saying? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> how are the frames in the stream? Let a motherfucking know how them frames is. God, he's playing PUBG again? Ugh. This isn't fair to your old subs, John. Unsub. Yeah, well. Unsub. Bye, Felicia. Fuck you. <laughs> Bye, Felicia. Bye, Patricia. Give me that, give me that. Oh, I just touched down and realized we're in first person. <laughs> Dude, why are there even pistols in this game? They're kind of useless, hey? Such a fucking waste of loot. Ooh, I got a tiny gun. It's a waste of, like... A space that you could put a gun. Waste of life. <laughs> Give me that. So a person asking on YouTube if someone wants pizza. I mean, if you're gonna send me a pizza. I do want some pizza. 
I made I made chili tonight with my shirt off. It was good. That was dope. <laughs> um, besides cleaning cat vomit off of my kitchen table, Amy knows but all you about did that. that. You did that shirtless too, so it was good too. I'm gonna run over to that warehouse because there may be some fat loots. Let me get that fat loot. Pudding. Uh, Domino's, not Pizza Hut. No one fucks with Pizza Hut. Yeah, if Peter's us. if Peter's all up in this stream, what's up, Peter? What up, buddy? He's an I, my sister-in-law's nephew. He's tight. Oh, cool. What a buddy. Not enough space. Fucking get out of here. Get out of here. Need a backpack. Same. I got a scar, though. I'm pretty happy with that. Aw, jealous. Sorry, babe. Aw. I need a freaking... Backpack, backpack. Come get your backpack. Clean up, clean up. Everybody, everywhere. There's a motorbike over here. We want to take it. Yo, get that motor bike. Okay, I'm going to try drive it without killing myself. Oh, there's a backpack. Yes. I'm gonna rock this Tommy gun for the entire round. I don't give a dunk. I'm yet to kill anyone with a Tommy gun. Every time I get one, I die. It's the best for, like, hit, just hip fire. Just straight up hip fire. Mm -hmm. Or hip fire, rather. I think I'm good. Oh shit, I forgot about motion sickness while I drive in this fucking mm. first person mode. It's kind of painful. Boots and pants and boots and pants. New shoes. Mm. <laughs> oh god. Am I? Okay. Am I? Let's go. Oh gosh. Here we go! Oh god! It's just flying at me. Ugh. That's a really good point. A lot better than seeing a bar in your face as you drive. Dude, I know, right? It's fucking obnoxious. That tiny failure. Are we sideways? I don't know. I can't tell. I don't think so. <gasps> Alright, I think we're good. <laughs> cool. Terrifying. Scary. Ooh. I am Give scared. Me that. Give me that. Clean up, clean up, everybody, everywhere. You don't know that song, do you? You guys didn't have Barney I... in Australia. Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. That's just the saddest thing. I'm sorry. I grew up on an mm. island. We were isolated. <laughs> we were raised on really, really bad entertainment. <laughs> you got no idea. Yeah, for entertainment, we got Jeremy down the street in Australia. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> he was our mate. Is there anyone else watching that's from Australia? 
Do you have any horror stories about Australian children's entertainment? <laughs> Uh, one that comes to mind is Blinky Bill. Oh, God. <laughs> Do I want to know what Blinky Bill is, is or is about? Um, well, Blinky Bill is a koala. There's uh, a can here. He's a koala, eh? Say no more. Yeah. I know all about them koalas. Oh. Drop bears. Pretend to be cute. Actually have chlamydia. <laughs> That's actually true. If you touch a koala and you make out with a koala, you'll get the clap. <laughs> it's a good way to go, though. So the crayon stealer is Australian. So you would know about how bad our children's entertainment is. Or was. It's gotten a bit better, I guess. What the frick? Alright. This place is tapped. Let's roll, babe. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Let's roll, babe. Vroom, vroom. Vroom, vroom. You want to get the bike? Thanks. Sorry. Fingernails. <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh, man. I'm playing with a girl who has really long fingernails. Okay, This so is going to be tough. If we lose, it's these. Bad I'll just I'll just blame it on Amy's sparkle nails. Mm, sorry guys. Whoa, Jesus. Okay. Ooh, uh. Oh gosh. <sighs> Why am I not verified? Because Twitch uh doesn't think I'm cool enough, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> Fuck verifications, dog. I don't need no check mark. Oh! Oh, that's a trick. <laughs> yeah, that is okay. Well, here we go. Let's go. <laughs> I worked out better than I thought it would. Oh, I'm going back the way I came. Christ <laughs> almighty. Yeah, so if it's not obvious enough, I'm shitty at driving in first person. <laughs> and I'm looking at the sky now. Holy oh crap. Ah. You know what? You drive. I don't give a shit. <laughs> drive me somewhere. You really, you really want that. Be my chauffeur. Dude, leave me without me. Uh. Yeah, I was just trying to get off the rock, sorry. <laughs> Alright, go, 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 go. Let's go. Where are we going? Bang, 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 bang. I don't know. Somewhere. Put a marker on the map. Uh, let's go. <laughs> let's go to the, this place. Because it's across the river. Alright, <sighs> well, let's die. This is gonna be good. Ambrose Sun, what up, boy? Uh... Crayon Stealer, your body is a temple. Don't show your body. Do, do we perform coitus? Is what he wants to know. Uh, That's a very bizarre question to ask it's, somebody. It's tough to perform coitus on a girl that is on the other side of the planet. But uh, we perform coitus on each other in spirit. Oh my goodness, what am I doing? What are you doing? I feel very are terrified. You okay? Yeah. Are I, you doing alright? Just we're gonna die. Shh, 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 shh. Don't say that. Don't feel like that. I'm gonna bang, bang, bang all over whoever tries to fuck with us. So don't worry. Oof, I'm gonna okay. go bang, 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 bang. And they'd be dead, 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 dead. Oh, this is. Actually, I'm gonna check this house. Make sure there's no fucking losers in there. You know what I'm saying? I kind of hope there are some losers because I want to be put out of my misery right now. Don't be like that. Oh, this game is just in first person terrifying. Yeah, you're right. Cybercoitus. <laughs> That's the name of my new band. Cybercoitus. Mm -hmm. That's dope. That's my new band name. Are there any fucking losers out here? No, 
no, no, no, no, no. We're in a pretty good spot. Yeah, this this house in particular, like, because it has like that upper floor balcony, and you can see, mm -hmm. like, whoever's running across the river. So it's a good, yeah, good little I'm up spot. Yeah, the other house. Mhm. Mm if you have like a sniper rifle, you can like fucking devastate. It'd be cool if I could see someone, and if I had a decent scope. Which I think I say every time I play this game. And... Nomad Sand TV says, uh, I totally get you guys. I'm in the same situation with someone. That's cool, man. I would say that it gets better. And, uh, you know, as long as you have somebody who makes you happy and uh, you look forward to talking to every day and you know kind of sharing your life and experiences with especially the cleaning of the cat vomit yeah so my cat <laughs> threw up on my table and I didn't know about it until I sat down at my table and I looked to my left and I'm like oh there's there's puke So she got to watch me clean cat vomit on Skype. That was pretty dope. Mm-hmm. Best part of my day. It's pretty dope. Someone on YouTube asks if I'm a thick boy lover. Um, <laughs> duh. Nah, she actually can't stand him. She's, like, yeah. super, like, against the thickness. She's not down with the thickness. I keep seeing you running and thinking, oh, there's a boy, I'm going to kill them. I'm like, I, mean, I can't kill that one. Please don't shoot me. <laughs> so how was your week, Amy, since the last time we streamed? My week has been boring. I have been working, and today is my day off, and it's fantastic. I'm jealous. Always I've also... looking forward to it. I've also been working, and, uh, yee. I hate it. <laughs> Let's talk about how much we hate our jobs. There are lots of people will be able to join in with us. Oh my god, dude, so... Uh... My job sucks. A lot. I work in a call center. <laughs> it's pretty rad, right? So fun. It's like a lot of fun. Call center job. I schedule appointments for oil changes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's an important thing to do in this world. Otherwise, everyone's cars would break and we'd have to see them outside walking. Oh man, you'd have to learn how to do oil changes all on your own. I hear some noise. Mm -hmm. So, I think it was up over this hill. You're like, I hear some boys, so I'm gonna run towards them. Yeah. And with this. Um. Hey, I'm just running through a field. Hey. Not in the open. 360 boosh. There we go. Oh, Jesus. Uh, they're at Southeast 150. Going in the house because I have to heal. <laughs> there was a hey, boy out in them hills. Are they behind the rock? Uh, they're up on the hill, like Southeast 150 ish. He's probably, yeah. uh. Oh, I'm totally coming out. Yeah, I can't see him. He must have, like, dropped down over the hill. I'm gonna run around oh, the other side. Ah! Oh no, Fucker. I'm in the house. Careful. No! Oh, no! oh I had a Shit. mini Fit 14. Get the fucking laser. 
Dang it! Ugh, so close. Ugh. There's a boy in there. We weren't careful. That was a boy. An awful, awful boy. Mm. You didn't. You didn't follow the crayon stealer's advice, dude. To be careful. To be careful. <laughs> All right. Sorry. Anyway, uh, incredibly fast, Timo. Who's the samey person? What's up, boy? Dancing rat. What up, boy? Welcome. Uh, thanks for sticking around. If you're on YouTube, uh, feel free to head on over to the Twitch. It's in the description. And we're having a lot of fun. And there's my teeth. <laughs> and my tongue. Ugh. 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 How bad is it? It's disgusting. It's like all detailed and disgusting. Someone on YouTube wants to know if we can squat up. If you can squat up? I don't know. If you want to squat, I mean, I wasn't really planning on squatting tonight, but. Uh, Maybe we can plan something for next week. Yeah, I think, like, when I actually advertise the stream. Yeah. I think maybe we can, uh, you know. Catch you later, Looty20. Thanks for coming. I love you. I love you. We can have people play with us and realize how bad we are. Yeah, we're not good. <laughs> we're not good at this game. Okay. Um. Ooh, you know what? If we're dropping near Georgia Pole, mm -hmm. we can try going to the six pack over here. Okay, well, let's try that. Yeah, we can try. Go drop off a three, two, one, bang. Press. So Press. Propusio Luminoso. I love you too, boy. Love you too, buddy. <laughs> Why do I call it a six pack? Because it looks like a little six pack, you know? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Go into the water. Boop, 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 boop. I like this little strip. It's a little fucking. You can't. You still can't look all the way down in first person when you're parachuting. It's really annoying. Mm -hmm. Oh Christ. Oh my god. Oh, the server. <laughs> you okay? Just like, it's so laggy. Ugh. I like click on a thing and it's like, oh, you want to open the door? Oh, okay, sure. Here you go. <laughs> Esports ready. <laughs> Esports. like nothing. I'm so glad that people can see you play and not me because I just walked into a wall. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like failing so hard. Uh, there we go. I'm not finding anything. Oh, I just found an M4. Hell yeah. There's a level 2 vest and an AK up here for you. Yep, if I find my way out of this maze of a house in first person, I'm sure I'll get it. <laughs> Suck my Terry folds. <laughs> no. My flip, flappy foldy flaps. Terry folds. <laughs> Is everyone like Rick and Morty? Are we all on the same page with the Rick and Morty? Are you guys good? You guys cool? So 
someone on YouTube said, please be Terry Folds. <laughs> I am Terry. I, he, I am the Terry Folds man. He was singing about me. Suck my flaps, you piece of shit. <laughs> yeah, Rocco's <laughs> modern life, he did work for a sex hotline. He totally did. There was an episode where they just, like, fucking... So good. They just talked about him working at a... You know, a fuck line. Like, it ain't one... It ain't no thing. Oh, Tommy Gun. Why is the Tommy Gun so common now? Yeah, I'm not sure. At first it was like we never found one, and now we just, like, keep finding them. Exactly. It's like... I don't know. I guess they got my emails that said, I want the Tommy Gun Bar. <laughs> Oh god. The flappy foldy holds. I'm trapped in a doorway. Nice. Right. Nice. Nice. So I got like a pretty much like a tricked out M4 right now. And if I just get randomly headshot from somebody with an SKS, I'll be really sad. Let me know if you find any 556. Five, I just uh, did, but I'm using it for the mini 14 I found. Whatever. Oh, sorry, babe. Whatever. When I run around with it, you can watch me with it, okay? Yeah, when you die, I'm gonna take it from you, because you fucking want it. <laughs> I want it. Mm -hmm. Oh, found some, found some. Dope. Is that you? Yep, it's me. Oh, okay. Whew. Sorry. Got all anxious. Oh, there's a scar. Shit. Do I want the scar? Um. Hmm. Mm. Take the range. You know what? We're sticking with the M4. It's gotta happen. Does a motherfucker like me and we'll give a fuck. John, teach us the way on how to pimp. Okay, first, uh, <clears throat> step one is you go to Walmart and, uh, just slather yourself in mayonnaise. Hot. And then just wait for the bitches to flock to you. I'm sorry, I said the B word. That was inappropriate. You're so naughty. You're gonna get banned from the internet now. Yeah. Stream has been taken offline. We don't have Walmart in Australia. Thank God. Yeah, Woolworths. We do have Woolworths, but it's and Big Woolworths w. is much better than than Walmart. 
Dude, fucking everything's better than Walmart. <laughs> I remember once walking around a Walmart at like 2 a.m. trying to find beach towels. Um, <laughs> and just like going through all the weird camo clothing they had there and just being like, this is an alternate universe. Did you landscape. get a, did you get a fucking, did you get a Canadian tuxedo? <laughs> no. That's what it, no. that's what you call a camo, a, gear. a camo suit. <laughs> Do you want a scar? Want... There's a scar down here. Yeah, I'm gonna stick with the M4. Thank you, though. Fine. Don't have the scar. Fine. Whatever. Be that way. Fucking fine. Whatever. John, one million subs. Cover yourself in mayo in Walmart. <laughs> yeah. Fucking say I won't do it, dude. There's a scar. <laughs> Is that the scar you were talking about, AB? That's the one. Was that the one? I'll give you a face scar if you don't stop. Hey, hey got him. I'll shoot you. I'll shoot you. Got him. Where are we in the circle? Oh. Um, not too bad. Not too bad. Have I taught you any Australian slang yet? Um. A bogan? <laughs> yeah. Um, honestly, I thought bogan meant like, like a chode, like a penis that's like <laughs> wider than it is long. Mm -hmm. Um, but it actually I means know. like, a, like a like a redneck. Per is it like a racial slur? <laughs> Should I not be saying that right now? Bogan. No, no, it's kind of like. It's really hard to describe. I guess it kind of does marry up a bit with like an American redneck, but with a bit of an Australian flavor. <laughs> gotcha. I guess like hick would be. Oh yeah, but you maybe. can be bogan. You can be bogan and still be quite well off. Like I feel like redneck kind of implies a poor person, whereas a bogan can be rich, but they're still black class, and then they're a bogan. Uh, like, yeah, you I can guess, be Bogan yeah. and still have all your teeth. <laughs> um, I don't know. There are some, like, super fucking, like, redneck folks around my neck of the woods. And they're actually pretty fucking wealthy because they're farmers. <laughs> and <laughs> farmers make, like, ridiculous amounts of money every year, so. Well... What do they farm? Spicy memes? <laughs> the spicy meme farmers. They reach down I'm into sorry. the dirt and pull out some fucking inhale seagull. Oh god. <laughs> this is Old meme. Here. Old meme. Dead meme. Old meme. Dead. As a dead meme, I can also confirm this. There's yeah, probably a car what? around the hospital, so I'm gonna go that way. They can take your memes from you, but they can't take your hotness. <laughs> Ew. I'll have to show John. What's a Tim Tam slam? I don't know what that is. He knows what a Tim Tam is. I I like Tim Tams a lot, actually. I like I like Tim Tams better than Oreos. What is a Tim Tam Slam? Is something sexual? Is that where you put Tim Tams in your vagina? Hey, if if it involves sex and Tim Tams, I'm there. Yeah, it's probably a good time. It sounds like a mm -hmm. like a great fucking time. I found a buggy. When you buy a Oh Jesus fuck! Like a... oh, crap, no. <laughs> uh, get behind the buggy. Oh, crap, 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 crap. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck, dude. That's fuck! Too much thinking about Tim Tams. 
Yeah, all this talk of Tim Tans has gotten gotten me soft. It's gotten my my wits dull. So a Tim Tam slam, I know what you're talking about. It's where you bite like the the ends off the Tim Tam and like you would drink through the Tim Tam like hot chocolate or coffee or something. And the inside gets all melty and then you eat it and it's pretty good. That actually sounds pretty good. Next, next time I send you some Tim Tams, you'll have to do it. It sounds like a lot of work, though. <laughs> no, it's not. I just want to. I just want to slam Tim Tams down my gullet and not have to worry about like, <laughs> sur like Tim Tam surgery. It sounds like a lot of work. <laughs> it's worth it. Anyway. Every time we die, I'm going to have to mention, Hey, we're on Twitch. Please join us. I love you. If you're on YouTube, come on over. The link is in the description. And if you watch me on Twitch, then I will give you a handjob. How about that? I'll literally come to your house and I'll give you a personalized handjob. And I'll give it a little kiss, too. I'll give it a kiss and I'll I'll sing you a song. It'll be worth it. Here we go. Let's do like a crazy round. Do we're you want to go to the school? Um, we're gonna fly right over the shooting range. <laughs> okay, let's go to the shooting range. It's right here. In case you didn't know. It's right here. It's right here. It's right here. All right, three, two, one, bang. Whee! How many fucking Australians are there in the chat? Apparently everyone but me knows what a Tim Tam Slam is. I didn't know that's what it was called, though. I knew what it was, but I didn't know it was called that, so... Suck my Tim yeah, why... Tam. Why are there so many Australians? Australians are like a rash that you can't get rid of. <laughs> Amy, how dare you? <laughs> hey, fuck you. Come here, Terry yeah, Crews. Fuck you. I need a gun. I need don't a gun. run. Don't run. Don't run. I'm terrified. Actually, you know what? Fuck it. Oh, Jesus. No. Oh, crap. Ah! Gun. Woo! Oh, my God. I'm fucked. Ah! Oh. <laughs> no. Oh, my God. Oh, that was so close. Gun. God damn it. <clears throat> There's no guns. There's just ammo. Everyone's watching you, Amy. I don't like this. Everyone. There's a boy in that house, and I... Oh, look at you. Look at you in the M16. <laughs> You're a smelly girl. I'm a die. There's a boy right there. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> Whatever. That was a crazy round. <laughs> the hills are alive with the sound of music. John you has a secret here. vid. Can you link me? Men at work all star. <laughs> I tried. I actually legit tried men at work. I come from a land of Mender. I think last week when we played, someone made a clip on Twitch of you humming Learn Down Under while watching me die, basically. <laughs> Sounds like something I would do. Because you are a smart ass. John, have you tried a me accent? Yeah, he has. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not good at it. Oh, I'm not good at it. Let's see. Mate. 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 <clears throat> Mate. 
right. You're a sick cat, mate. You sick cat. I didn't need a Vegemite sandwich because I don't like Vegemite. It's disgusting. It's not real food. Vegemite is vegetarian. It's disgusting. Right? Isn't veg wasn't Vegemite discovered when they like scraped all the crap off of the bottom of barrels and like breweries? <laughs> Probably. Ew. Sounds about right. Where, Where are, are we going? Um, every time we drop off somewhere dangerous, I get fucked. Let's drop off right here Oops. at the farm. Oops, Bang. No, the farm. Okay. <laughs> it's not very dangerous. You're not very dangerous. That is correct. I am a very boring girl. <laughs> the crayon stealer asks, would you eat John's ass? <laughs> I think the real question here is, who wouldn't? <laughs> <laughs> My ass is not snack. Oh, there's a fucking... There's two boys here. There's like four boys here! There's like a whole squad! That's God boys. damn it. Oh, my fucking gourd. Oh my squash. Gun, please. Gun. Gun, please. I have a sickle. That's tight. That's not gonna help you. Nope. Oh, thank god. What the fuck was that? Okay. Alright. Hey, I'm gonna go fucking punch this guy in the dick. Hey, fuck you. <laughs> yeah, I died upstairs in that there. stupid house. That stupid smelly house. Gun with no ammo, yeah. <laughs> it's helpful. Really? There's no gun ammo. Right. Probably took the ammo. There's two boys out there. In that house. I don't even care if I die. I don't even care. My name's Amy. I don't care. You're getting shot no. at. Look at you. Flash him. Smoke him out. <laughs> Oof. I don't care. So, Austin on YouTube, um, John is reading comments, but over on Twitch. So, if you would like to ask him on a date, you will need to go to Twitch. Yeah, I'm just reading the Twitch. I'm not even reading YouTube. Sorry, bro. Sorry, bro. I really mm. hate first person, so let's just do, like, the regular boy. Mm. Why carry on Steeler? I feel like... You, you're just very stuck on this idea about the Vegemite in the butt. Mm -hmm. That'd burn, wouldn't it? Oh, crown stealer. Ooh. Mm. That's how you get temporarily blocked, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Aesthetic gamers, thank you, bro. Or man, or girl, I don't know. I don't fucking know. <sighs> Nomad Sand TV thinks that Vegemite in the butt would burn. And I agree. It's like a Ugh, spicy. I don't want to think about it. Ugh. It's like a spicy shite. You know what gun I've never played with yet is the, uh, the Mach 14. I've never had that gun before. Which one? The, the new, like, enhanced battle rifle. Or whatever the fuck. The EBR Mach 14. 
It sounds like it sucks. <laughs> mm. Flysters. Australian Fibby. Let's go right here, because I like it. Mm -hmm. It's a good little spot, little, little spicy little spot. Australians don't kill, don't drink flusters. Right, Hello, two, don't one, kill bang. There we go. I got a <laughs> sentence out. <laughs> I tried. What is, um, what is Australians' favorite, Australia's favorite beer? I wonder. I have no idea. I don't drink beer, so... Hey, Ambrose, son, what's your dad drink? <laughs> but your dad carries a pocket knife. We're tumbling hey, Anthony. Down. Thickness be with you, Anthony. Oh, hi, Danker. Anthony. What up, buddy? Oh, come on, fucker. Please! Oh my... So slow to get down. Okay. <laughs> um... Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, good God. This fucking game. <laughs> this game's a travesty. Uh... <sighs> You want to come to Australia someday, don't kill dog. You're pretty close to Australia in Indonesia, so... <laughs> yeah. You could come here and experience our racism and other beautiful <laughs> things we have on this island. So, is it true, like, so Australians are racist? I like feel you that guys they are, yeah. Like, you guys don't really have, like, I don't know, Africans? No. <laughs> hmm. That's weird. Like, I figured you guys were, like, multicultural and all this other garbage. I mean, it's not garbage, but... It's probably a, a similar kind of deal to the U.S. I feel like there's a lot of racism here. Same thing, same Australians? Thing with like, yeah. They're kind of, like, more casually racist, and it's really gross. <laughs> Like, you'll just call some somebody, like, a underhanded racist term, and then they yeah. get kind of secretly offended, but not say anything. I saw a thing online today saying that um, Outback Steakhouse in the U.S. is kind of being called out for being racist in the U.S. by <laughs> saying really? that the, the Bloomin' Onion is ab-original. What is their marketing department doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. So um, we've only got like eight Outback Steakhouses in the whole of Australia. And they don't write that on the menu because they clearly realize it's kind of gross. But, yeah. Well, I mean... I like Out Outback Steakhouse. I think they have, uh, I think their food's pretty, pretty good. Um, I don't really fucking want to make a cultural statement by going there. <laughs> I just want to, uh, I want a fried onion. Like, a, yeah, anyone who knows me knows my affinity to destroying blooming onions at Outback Steakhouse. <laughs> we should definitely kill a couple blooming onions while you're here. We're going to, for sure. Kinda can't wait. <laughs> There's an Outback Steakhouse down the street from my house. And, uh... The, the waitress that works there is always high. <laughs> <laughs> but... The food's good. I think. Dink I Anthony a time. says... How good is Golden Corral? I can say that Golden Corral is not good. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so if you want to talk about, like, race for a little bit, <laughs> which I totally don't, but if you want to talk about race for a bit, uh, Amy knows this story. 
So we went to the Outback State, or fucking, we went to Golden Corral. Um, this is like, I want to say maybe like 10 years ago. But uh, we went to Golden Corral on like a Friday night, so it was kind of like, you know, it's going to be crowded. And uh, that's when they were introducing like the chocolate fountains and stuff, and they had like all these new menu items. So, um, we get there, it's just, like, me and my mom and my brother, and, uh, <laughs> we, we get inside, and, like, we look around, and we're literally the only white people there, and the place is fucking packed, <laughs> and, like, everyone just stops and looks at us, and we're just like, shit, <laughs> like, it wasn't, it wasn't scary or anything, it was just, like, I've never been in that situation before. So it was just, it's fucking terrifying. I don't know, man. Golden I've never. Golden food is substandard. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I've never been the only white dude in a room before, and I come from like a kind of a white neighborhood, I guess you could say. So. You be spooky. It was spooky. <laughs> Not spooky in that way. Oh my Jesus Christ. Uh, I'm gonna stop talking. I'm just gonna make you feel uncomfortable. Stop. <laughs> Fuck me. I went to Golden Corral once and maybe there was a cute boy there and maybe I stalked him. <laughs> Have I think a cute boy. Story, John. A cute boy, do you mean? <laughs> Was he thick? Was he a thicky? He was, and he was destroying a buffet, and it was my favorite thing in the world at that point in time. Did you get his number? <laughs> no. He's like, I like the way you eat, sir. <laughs> Can I have your number? That's my memory of Golden Corral. It's pretty funny. We need a vehicle. And I need a gun. I can't believe I scoured both of those fucking buildings and didn't find any actual guns. I found like a hundred backpacks, but yeah, no guns. Anthony says your eyebrows look good today, Amy. Oh, thanks, Anthony. That's that's a cool compliment. Amy looks. Oh, she can... always looks so pretty on stream. Shut up. She her oh, makeup is always on fleek, and her hair is always perfect. She always looks so good. So John saw me before I did my hair this morning, though. <laughs> Anyone who has me on Snapchat would have seen my vertical hair. Vertical hair. Well, your hair always looks cute and yummy. Can we stop discussing my hair? Oh, my goodness. Amy's hair is made of rainbows. <laughs> I think I see a car. Is that a bike? Yeah, I see a bike. Woo. Do you want a... I can give you an Uzi. <laughs> no, I'm good. I'm gonna wait until I can find a fucking... Am I even wearing a vest? I don't even know. Am I dressed today? <laughs> Did I put on pants this morning? Way. Oh, hey. there you are. <laughs> I'm here. Get in the sidecar, you psycho. Oh. God. Uh, You're like an idiot in the sidecar. Complete my aesthetic. John wears no pants, you just can't see. Can confirm. Yeah, I actually have not worn pants in over 20 years. Every shot of me has been from the from the chest up. You're going to start some kind of crazy conspiracy theory now that you've actually got flipped. Oh my or What the f Oh my god. Wow. Um stay still. Cool. 
Sick trick, bro. Sick tricks. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have healing stuff? Yeah, I have a med kit. Okay. It's a shame I have to fucking use it right now, but... Sure. I know, right? That was very, very scary. Do you have healing stuff? Yeah, I'm good. I'm just popping some painkillers. I flipped my vet. Anyway. I have seen done. a picture of you with pants on. Anthony, shh. Don't. Don't debunk the conspiracy. I want to start the rumor that John actually has flippers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like a merman. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my god. What are you doing today? <sighs> Not driving. That's for fucking sure. <laughs> fuck that fence. Give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. Oh, uh, these houses have been opened. Uh oh. There's boys around here. They actually might still be here. Are there boys? Uh, this house, boys? I mean, is clear. I'm pretty sure the one I was just in was clear because I didn't hear anyone upstairs. Yeah, I think our boys are gone. Yeah, our boys are long gone. But any decent loot is also long gone. Would John or Amy kill the spider? Um, I'm Australian. It's a stupid Amy, question. Amy does not fear spiders. Get in the sidecar. Get in the sidecar. Get in the sidecar. Where are we? Eh. We... Wait, does he mean Varus the spider? Who lives in King's Landing? No. Oh, just making sure. Let's go to an apartment building. I bore this. Oh, these are fucking open too. Damn it. Hmm. They have been looted. Did I see someone up there? If you think you did, you probably did. I'm coming up. Ding dong. Do you want me to follow you? No. All right, well, I'm yeah. going to because I'm annoying and it I'm was, gonna. It was my imagination. Okay. Ding dong. Delivery. You get the death. Huh. Like, I almost want to cause like a bunch of ruckus and just. just fucking. Oh. I'm here! Oh, that's you. John, what are you doing? It's, I'm causing a ruckus. Oh, I'm up here. I'm in this building. Come on up and get me. Like that Death Grip song. You know the one. Oh my god. I'm gonna go this whole round without finding a fucking gun. What's that in your hand if you don't have a gun, John? A stupid stick with nothing in it. I found it in the woods. It's a stick. I found a crossbow. <laughs> Let's go to the school. Yeah. There's not going to be anyone at the school. Are there, like, boys there? Like, I don't know, man. Oh, you hear some fire. Yeah, I think it's coming from like north. This game is taking a while. Damn. We could steal that car and go elsewhere. Where? The blue one. Oh. 
Um, let me go inside the school first. YouTube wants to know who the fuck is Amy. Amy is a girl who John found on a street corner and paid good money <laughs> to play PUBG with. <laughs> what a good explanation. <laughs> yeah. Uh, did you know they could jump through windows if you're really, if you're like super pro, like MLG? Yeah, I've seen someone do that before, and I was like, I want this power, but I don't understand. I don't. I don't, I don't know how. I think you have to crouch. I'm gonna try and jump through a window. I don't know how to do it. I don't know. Fucking Shroud is really good at it, and I'm not, so I'm not gonna try. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't no fucking Dr. Disrespect. Jumping through windows and doing all kinds of crazy garbage. Run and crouch. That's, that's what I figured. I just face-planted a wall. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna take this Mandarin jacket. <laughs> what? Sounds hot. Ooh, I found an M16. Tight. Uh, I need to go there. Take you. Thanks. We can't talk about Shroud in this stream because um, last time we talked about Shroud, John got killed. <laughs> so it's jinxed. Hang on, so it's run and crouch? But don't you have to jump too? Like. I don't know. I don't fucking know. <laughs> Can we I'm not gonna try. try and jump through windows. <laughs> it's a hack. It's a fucking hack. I can't do it. But that's not telling of anything because I'm awful at this game. The same. I keep hearing your footsteps, and I keep getting freaked out. Because I have, like, PTSD from this place. <laughs> I'm gonna jump through this window, though. Bang! Alright, let's get in this car. Mm, do you want to head to where I just chucked that blue marker? Yeah. Don't want to go... Here we go now, here we go now. Oh, you're, you marked this place. <laughs> I kind of just marked it because it was in the middle. Oh, I think there's somebody here. Yes, let's get them. They're upstairs. Howdy. Oh. oh, bitch. Coming. No. Avenge me. You must avenge me. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> he just ran in. Idiot. All right. Oh Christ. Wow. This is a popular place. Oh, okay. Uh oh. Oh, Jesus. Oh, he knows I'm in here, so. That's cool. Wait for him to come to daddy.
Jesus fucking. Oh my god. I'm gonna hide in the fucking bathroom. Thank you, thank you. Where the fuck are they? Oh, Jesus. Is he on the roof? This is anxiety inducing just to watch. Alright, I'm gonna go out the back door. I'm gonna need to get like to a vantage point or something. Uh, I can't see dick. Try. Now they know where you are. You have brought the boys to you. Good. Let them come. Oh, there's a crate here. I think that's why. That's why. Oh! oh! Jesus! Uh oh. Oh, I know where he is. What the? F This game, John. This game. This fucking game. <laughs> Connecting. Oh my god, this fucking bullshit. Connection closed, thank you. Restarting. <laughs> yeah, mine's not connecting. So stupid. Firecase eighty nine, what up, boy? What's up, boy? <clears throat> oh god. <sighs> connecting. Fucking please. This happens at least once every time we play. It just has like these connection issues. What, where it just doesn't connect and we have to stop playing? <laughs> mm -hmm. And we actually have to like talk to each other? It's weird. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Alright, you know what? Fuck it. <laughs> I'm done with this game anyway. <laughs> Let's just there talk to some people. Or pat the guitar. Talk to some people. I don't give a fuck. 
I don't give a fuck. I don't give a, I don't give a, I don't give a fuck, every Let me do this. Bang. So I'm going to meme John and see how his positioned but a go-kart underneath him. Well, he will look like he's riding a go-kart. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What? <laughs> okay. All right. I mean, feel free. Feel free to do that. Yeah, that would be sick. Oh, what other yeah. what other food or drinks have you given John? <laughs> Unfortunately, not enough, <laughs> apparently. That's a loaded question. <laughs> um, what did I, what have I sent you? I've sent you Tim Tams. I have sent you, um. You sent me, uh, fucking, what do you call it? The Wonder Ball or whatever? Or no, the, the Kinder Surprise Egg. Remember? Oh yeah, Kinder Surprise. I got this um, dope this car. In my Kinder Surprise Egg. It's a little yellow boy. See? And um I sent you a whole bunch of stuff. I can't remember anything I sent you. I sent you that really salty chocolate. You sent me a lot of shit actually. You sent, sent me like that, that Yeah. Licorice chocolate. The licorice chocolate was really good. It had like sea salt in it. Um I didn't send any Milo. I should have sent some Milo. I forgot about Milo. <laughs> what is Milo? Um, it's like a... You're supposed to make it with milk. It's kind of like a malted chocolate drink. But I just eat it with a spoon. I don't eat it in a drink. <laughs> is it like Nesquik? <laughs> or like... I don't know. It's sort of similar, but it's like more grainy and it's way better. Hmm. I didn't send any Vegemite because it's disgusting. Static Beats, he's beating it, lol. <laughs> I am. Do I it. am, actually. Right Ugh. now. On Twitch. Uh. Um, what American snacks have you not had, Amy? Because I know you I'm like Butterfinger, and, uh... <laughs> I don't like Butterfinger. <laughs> um, well, I feel like you have said things before, and I've been like, I really need that, and then... I haven't tried it, but I can't remember what they are. I like, um... I think probably the f my, my favorite thing that you've sent me was the that licorice chocolate. Like, with the with the sea salt. That was um, pretty good. And the fucking Supernova Doritos, like the blue Doritos. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot about those. That was yeah, fucking wild. Doritos. Yeah, we don't we don't have those in America. The green Doritos, um, <laughs> they're good. I like them. You guys should do this quiz. Thirty six questions in love. Oh God. <laughs> All right. Do I want to? It sounds. This looks nauseating. Read one uh -oh. question aloud to your partner, then both of you answer. It takes an hour. I don't have an hour in my life. This site provides the ideal experience for exploring these questions, so grab some times. I mean, wine. <laughs> Click here to start. Read one question aloud to your partner. Should take. <laughs> Let's just like do a speed run. Hang on. Okay. I'm gonna fucking hang on. Okay, you can only answer with five words. You can only answer with five words. Okay, I'll do. I'll go That'll first. Uh, if okay, now question number one: If you could invite anyone in the world to dinner, who would it be? Julian Assange. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Okay, I guess you go. <laughs> okay, if you could invite anyone in the world to dinner, who would it be? Um, shit. You would invite shit to dinner. GG <laughs> <G>. Allen. <laughs> cool. Uh, question number two. Would you like to be famous in what way? Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> um, John, would you like to be famous in what way? Um, I 
would like to be a YouTuber and play PUBG. Maybe you <laughs> should get some subscribers. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> All right, then you then there you go. Just you go next. Okay. Before making a telephone call, do you ever re rehearse what you're going to say and why? <sighs> okay. So as a person who works in a call center, I uh, have a procedure, and it goes pretty much the same time every way, or every time rather. That would uh, be more than five words. <laughs> Uh, before making a telephone call, do you ever rehearse what you're going to say? No. <laughs> Never. How about you? I don't call people on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. I order my dominoes online, so it doesn't matter. Uh, number four, what would constitute a perfect day for you? Uh, video games, pizza, and sleep. <laughs> Mine would probably <laughs> pretty much be the same, I would say. And probably, like sleep and fucking I don't know just in my underwear oh yeah underwear definitely just food <laughs> when did you last sing to yourself or to someone else <laughs> I sang to a group of people uh, I sang in a land, a land down under <laughs> mm -hmm. how about you I honestly can't remember it was probably to you while we were playing PUBG. <laughs> that sounds about right. Oh, God. If you're... Number six. If you're able to live to the age of 90 and retain either the mind or body of a 30-year-old <laughs> for the last 60 years of your life... You know what? We're skipping this one. Fuck that one. <laughs> That's too long. Too many words. Number seven. Do you have a secret hunch about how you will die? <laughs> oh, that's morbid. Oh. Um... Jesus. I'm probably going to crash my car. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay. Um, a secret hunch about how I will die. Uh, I don't know. I'll probably get heart disease when I'm 50 or something. Who knows? That's morbid. I don't like that question. Yeah, this sucks. Um, okay, your turn. Name three things you and your partner appear to have in common. Uh, like I said before, sleep. <laughs> Pizza and we, video games. We both <laughs> we both have an affinity for narcissism, <laughs> so there's that. That too. Yeah. <laughs> oh goodness. Number nine. For what in your life do you feel most grateful? Mexican food. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna just gonna fucking say Mexican food because that's so perfect. Mm -hmm. All right. Go ahead. If you could raise, ugh, if you could change anything about the way you were raised, what would it be? Um, my parents would be rich and I'd have lasers for eyes. <laughs> uh, I would be born to a richer family. <laughs> we're both so materialistic. <clears throat> oh my god, it's so true. Um, number 11 take four minutes and tell your partner your life story in as much detail as possible uh we've only got five words though oh shit that's right okay mm. my life story in five words Ugh. um born awkward <laughs> masturbating <laughs> video games that's dead inside words. that's six words seven <laughs> that's awful okay I, I guess I have to say born awkward <laughs> stupid <laughs> um, featuring kangaroos there you go that's <laughs> sounds good alright your turn if you could wake up tomorrow having gained any one quality or ability what would it be does that include like supernatural? <laughs> yeah, let's let's go with that. If I could, if I had one, if I could have like one superpower, it would be uh, the ability to have nacho cheese appear on any article of food in front of me. That's that's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Um. That's pretty good. What's the question again? Wait, I'm reading the question again because I forgot it. <laughs> um, <laughs> Okay, I guess that if I could do 
like one sort of supernatural thing, I'd be able to fly. That would be cool. Lame, boring, no, snore. No, awesome. That you would... could like ambush the shit out of people. I could what fly if, like... house right now, John. <laughs> but what if it was like flying where you could only fly like a couple inches like every minute? No, no I actually you just know? would become a plane. There you go. <laughs> 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 become a plane all right number 13 if a crystal ball could tell you the truth about yourself or your life or the future of anything else what would you want to know are aliens real <laughs> you know what that's that's pretty good i think aliens are pretty important did you know if we what found out if we found out that aliens were real it would like debunk christianity and fucking everything that we know mm -hmm. about, like, religion. So last night, the last thing I texted John before I fell asleep unceremoniously was, I don't want to sleep, I want to talk about aliens. So. <laughs> it's very true. <laughs> it's pretty dope. They were staying up late last night talking about aliens. Is there something that you've dreamed of doing for a long time? Why haven't you done it? Say that again? If there's something that you've dreamed of doing for a long time... Um, quitting my job. <laughs> I don't know. It's freaking, why haven't I done it? Because I had uh, money. <laughs> um, and I'm scared. I'd have to say the same thing. Quitting mm. my job. I could just be like, you know what? I'm going to stream fucking six days a week. And I'm going to make a you know, hundred million subscribers. And fucking whatever. But that's not going to happen. So, whatever. Next question. All right. Um, number 15. What is the greatest accomplishment of your life? I have right. gotten to the age of 31 years old and not died. <laughs> <laughs> That's your life's greatest? Come on. Come on. No. Like, that is seriously an accomplishment. I could have died at any point. Well, you've outlived pretty much everyone in the Middle Ages because the average lifespan was, like, 30 yeah. Yeah. What about you? Um, my greatest accomplishment. I don't know. Like seven hundred and thirty thousand YouTube subs is pretty dope. And uh, I got to write music and go on tour a couple times, so that was pretty cool. Yeah, I think you've accomplished a lot of cool things. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, number sixteen. What do you value most in a friendship? Uh, mutual disdain of humanity. <laughs> what do I value most in a friendship? Um, that they don't ask me to hang out too much, because I don't like going out. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I don't know, I'd oh, rather I just it. stay home and fucking masturbate and eat Cheetos. At the same time? D dude, like, Cheeto dust makes great lube, like, you didn't know that? Like, come yes. on. Love it. Right. What is your most treasured memory? Um, my most treasured memory. Hmm. There was one time when my dad took me and my brother to see uh, Undertaker versus Kane at WCW SmackDown <laughs> when I was like eight. That was pretty dope. I liked that a lot. That's cool. Um, and we went to Dave and Buster's afterwards. It was so fucking cool. What about um, you? I have no idea. <laughs> it probably involves eating food. <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> One time, I ate a piece of cheese and a strawberry at the same time. is great. Like in Ratatouille. I, no, I, I once put camembert cheese on Doritos. That was good. Camembert cheese is like natural queso. It's <laughs> the best. It's pretty damn um. good. So if you haven't put on Doritos, you should try that. <laughs> uh, uh, number 18. What's your most terrible memory? Terrible memory. What's your most terrible memory? Let's put it that way. Um, probably my dog dying at the beginning of this year. That was horrible. No. <laughs> I know. That's I, kind that, of a lame one. And but. that's, well, I mean, it's legit. Like, that's kind of, like, around when I met you. And, mm -hmm. uh. I don't know. It was like a weird time in your life, but I'm. I was glad that I could 
be there. Um, what's my most terrible memory? Uh, I don't want to bring the chat down or anything, but my dad passed away when I was 12. So, yeah, that was a that was a tough day. But uh, anyway, go ahead. Okay. Okay. If you knew that in one year you would die suddenly, would you change anything about the way you are living now, and why? <laughs> this is Anthony. Why did you suggest Anthony? What the fuck, dude? What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck, Anthony, dude? <laughs> this is getting deep, man. Um, I don't know. Fucking, of course I would. Like, I I wouldn't keep working in a call center. Like, I'm gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> like I, I, I would quit my job. I would, you know, use whatever assets I had, liquidate them, and just use the money to travel. I guess I don't know. You can't take your money with you. Yeah, that's so true. Yeah. What about you? Probably the same. I would, um, I'd go to work and walk out, just to be salty, and <laughs> I'd. Probably just like, yeah, go travel, come harass you. Poor thing. <laughs> That's kind of what I would do too. Um, I don't know, I, in all realness, I would definitely come see you and, uh, you know, that's what I would want to do. <laughs> it's a bonding experience for all of us. <laughs> Anthony, you have like unleashed this horrible thing onto the world. <laughs> Okay, yeah. what does friendship mean to you, John? What does friendship mean? Um, I don't know. Fucking friendship is a, somebody that you can both simultaneously laugh with and cry with and fight with and still come out on the other side. Like, you know, wake up the next morning like nothing ever happens. Yeah, so. that's a pretty good description of it. Mm-hmm. Like, uh, some of my band buddies I've known since, like, kindergarten, and I'll, I'll be friends with them probably until the day I die. Mm -hmm. So, pretty cool. Sorry, I'm just reading this question here in the chat, John. Who would you cosplay as? And you too, Amy. And someone wrote Roadhog and Widow. <laughs> Roadhog and, and Widow. To point out that Absolutely. Roadhog and Mercy is how we roll. <laughs> yeah, dude, fucking, yeah. But you would have to be blonde, so... I know. I've got the diva hair. I don't have the mercy hair. You would make a much better diva. TBH. <laughs> um, number 21. What roles do love and affection play in your life? What does that mean? What roles do they uh, play? I'm just going to say that I am a cold, heartless bitch. And we come <laughs> from that. <laughs> um... No, you're not. Shut up. Um, what roles do love and affection play in my life? I don't know. It's fucking, that's a dumb question. I'll go next. Yeah. Next. Don't care. Number 22. Uh, alternate sharing something you consider a positive characteristic of your partner. Oh, this is nauseating. <laughs> God. <laughs> Anthony, I hate you. Um, Can we just say dat ass and move on? Dat ass, dem titties, fucking who cares? Next. <laughs> <laughs> These are getting worse as we go. I'm gonna skip ahead and see, like, how. <laughs> oh my God, no. This is like a psychoanalysis. I know. It's like, I'm getting. It's like a shrink is, like, interrogating me. Do you feel your childhood was happier than other people's? I'm just going to pick a random question. Mm. Oh, this is like really... Anthony. It's really deep. It gets deeper as you go further. Oh my god, okay. So when you get to the end, it's like, in order to solidify your love, you have to look into your partner's eyes for four minutes in silence. Ew. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> it's terrifying. <laughs> I don't think I've ever looked in anyone's eyes that long before. <laughs> like, like, ever. What happens if you do look into someone's eyes for that long? Do you die? Uh, I don't know. 
Well, we'll have to we'll have to try it um, when we're together. I'll I, I guess I don't know. Not be able to do it for longer than about ten seconds. Okay, number twenty. How about this one? Number twenty six. Complete this sentence. I wish I had someone with whom I could share. Blank, blankety blank. Uh, definitely gonna have to be a food. <laughs> it's it's pretty pretty much the direction I was going. Oh, Someone I could fun. I could probably share like nachos with, you know, mm -hmm. that'd be, be pretty dope. Or like some, maybe some yeah. some queso, or some hummus. Why not both? Why not all of them? Por qué no los dos? Um, that one's Guitar too deep. Guitar is the best option. What? Tell your partner what you, you like about the them. No, don't stop. Share your partner an embarrassing moment. Okay, number 29. Share with your partner an embarrassing moment in your life. <laughs> um, um. Oh, Jesus. Dude, I have so many. Like, so many stick out to me. It's kind of bad. Um... I think I said something really mean to, uh, <laughs> it was, like, totally kidding, like, I wasn't trying to be mean or anything, but I did said something really mean to this girl, uh, in high school, and there were, like, a lot of people around, and she slapped me, <laughs> and I was, like, totally fucking <laughs> taken aback, I was just like, I was, uh, she just hit me, and everyone's, like, looking at me, and I was just like, oh, I don't know what to do, and I was just, like, totally red in the face, and I, I didn't know what to say. That's so. uh, awkward. Mm -hmm. Oh, and um, fucking, I used to play t-ball when I was like <laughs> six years old, and I hit the ball, and I was like totally stoked, but the pants that I was wearing like just were not staying up because they weren't made right, and my pants fell down while I was running to first base. <laughs> oh no. I have a similar thing when I was in, when I was at school, when I was probably about, yeah, seven or eight years old, on like this, the monkey bars and some kid like pulled my pants and my underpants down. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone like, got a crotch hanging shot? There, oh hanging my God. there with my, my butt and my vagina hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, usually like when ass and junk come out, that's going to stick with you. Mm -hmm. Um... What else? Oh my god, there's just so fucking so many. Um, oh, <laughs> again, in high school, fucking big surprise there, I was standing with a friend in the hallway, and uh, she was holding a drink, and I didn't realize that the cap was not on all the way, <laughs> and I was like half kidding, I just kind of like smacked it out of her hands, and it fucking went everywhere. <laughs> And there was, like, a teacher walking by, and she was like, No, why did you do that? Clean that up! Right now! And I'm just like, oh my, Jesus. It was not fun. I don't know. I was, like I was stupid. <laughs> I was a stupid kid. No, you weren't. When did you last cry in front of another person? Ugh. Tell your person no. something that you like about them. Shut up. Number 32, what, if anything, is too serious to be joked about? I'm drawing a blank. <laughs> I don't know, man. Uh, we just passed my favorite anniversary earlier this month. Uh, what's too serious to be joked about? I don't know, fucking, I, don't, I, I think in any context, like, anything can be joked about, like, if it's presented in a tasteful fashion, I don't know, Yeah. fucking child leukemia, I don't know, <laughs> I'm sure there'd still be a funny joke out there about it, there's gotta be something, like, Fucking... Donald Trump is too serious to be joked about. He is a joke. That yeah. is the joke. Yeah. T 
tasteful side oh. boob. <laughs> Tasteful side boob. I don't know. Um, honestly, I can't think of anything that's like too outlandish. Fuck it. Nah, who cares? We're just gross people. I went too far. I can't read any more questions because it's just at the end now. You can click back. Yeah, I'm just trying to do that. Um. These are getting, like, really long and, like, in-depth. I know these questions. Oh, mine are all screwed up. I broke the questions. <laughs> uh, here's a kind of a good one, I guess. Uh, number 34. Your house containing everything you own catches fire. After saving your loved ones and Panda and Chi-Chi mm -hmm. and Luna, you have time to safely make a final dash to save one item. And what would it be? And why? Um... That's a good question. Probably my laptop. <laughs> <laughs> All my nudes are on there. Yeah. I Well, my phone would be in my pocket, right? Yeah. I mean, that's where my so, nudes are, so... So, I mean... Why are we talking about this? Um, I would <laughs> save my laptop because I probably have the most use for that out of everything and I don't give a shit about sentimental stuff let it burn um I honestly don't know I mean it would be pretty sad to lose my computer cause like I you know I took pride in my computer because <laughs> I built it and it's nice and uh I don't know I'm like looking around the room there's not really much in here that I really care about enough to run through fire to rescue. <laughs> Save the weed. I have no weed. Um, I can't think of um, anything else I would save. Like I have, I, I have my PS3 that I don't play. <laughs> I've been yeah. meaning to sell. Fucking. I don't know, man. Like, I'm not really sentimental about, like, material shit. Like, I'm not, I'm not even attached to my guitar. Maybe my drum set, but I can't carry that, so that's gonna burn. <laughs> I'll just let the <laughs> renter's insurance cover that. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't think anything's really worth running back into a fire for. Really. No. <laughs> I don't know. Nothing. I wouldn't, I, I wouldn't run back in. I would save my... I'd, my phone would be in my pocket, and I would save my cat and my mom, and I'd get the fuck out. So maybe um, not the cat. Maybe not the cat. Yeah, I she can stay. I kid, I kid, I kid. Save your cat. <laughs> Share a personal problem and ask your partner's advice on how he or she might handle it. Also, ask your partner to reflect back to you. How you seem to be feeling about the problem you have chosen. Um, um, I have a current problem. It's called, uh, I would like some lunch delivered to me. <laughs> I would like, <laughs> I would like some room service. How are you going to that problem? Honestly, I don't know. I would like to move to like one of those big like luxury high rises that have like room service. Mm -hmm. That would be dope. Well, that can be the problem then. How do I go about moving into a luxury apartment and who is going to fund it? <laughs> that would, yeah, that would kind of be our our main issue that we have to solve. Mm -hmm. And the answer would be uh, sell everything we own and fucking move to somewhere where the rent is super low. So I guess we're moving to Serbia. <laughs> 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 there, I just we just solved our problems together. Yay! And Anthony has fixed my problem. He said, "Cold Dominoes." <laughs> um, I agree. It's actually a really good idea. That is a great idea. But I'm not going to. Congratulations! You've answered all the questions. Now for the hard part. 
to, to solidify your love, you have to look into your partner's eyes for four minutes on, in silence. Let's just stare into our webcams for four minutes and see how weird it can get. <laughs> I'm not doing this. <laughs> this is good TV. This is good TV. I'm not doing it, John. Please stop. This You're is, scaring me. This is good television right now. <laughs> I don't know, man. That was that was weird quiz, and I feel weird. I feel kind of violated. Yeah. This, this, I wasn't this, cheating because I never actually started. This quiz penetrated my my personal life, and I don't like it. I feel raped. Mhm. Mm like, we came here to play PUBG, and now we're talking about like our awful pasts and shit. Yeah, my my dark should, sticky past. We should ban Anthony. Anthony, you're banned. <laughs> Bad, dude. Anthony's banned forever. Ban hammer on Anthony. Mm hmm. Ugh. Oh, I gotta stretch my knees. I've been sitting here for too long. Same. Anyway, I'm gonna check. I'm gonna check YouTube. I feel really sorry for everyone that like had to sit through that. <laughs> yeah, I apologize. That was rough. It was rough for me, too. Mainly me. Mm. <laughs> She's wearing pants. <laughs> Anthony, I'm mm. sorry to break it to you, mate, but there's pants happening right now. <laughs> there's vodka in John's drink. There is. Said nudes. He's wasted. <laughs> oh. What now, Amy? What shall oh, we do? I, I feel sorry for everyone that watches us. Hey, like, I apologize. Can I get a shout out for all the Canadian thick boys? I feel like someone was the same person that asked that last week. Um, yeah. Fucking I mean, Canadians are dope. I love Canadians. Play some Overwatch. I played Overwatch yesterday. I did not play. I've, I haven't played Overwatch in like fucking like four months. We should play Overwatch someday. That would be cool. I suck at Overwatch, man. Like, I just fucking. I don't know. Like, I, yeah, I just start playing I, Overwatch, and I'm, I'm just, like, I can't really deal with, like, first, like, FPS, RPG garbage. I just want to shoot things, so. <laughs> <laughs> it's not too bad. I played yesterday, and someone took D.Va, who I like to play, and someone took Mercy, who I like to play, so I ended up playing May, and I actually, like, enjoyed it, so. Good. Low-level mm. Overwatch is great. Yeah, we're, we're not good. John's better than I am at Overwatch. I'm not, actually. <laughs> you are, actually. I'm, I remember us playing Overwatch together, and it was just, like, embarrassing. I'm better than no one. <laughs> <laughs> um, open shirt, show bob. Show bobs. Blink-182 or Green Day. Oh, that's... Can I pick neither? Did I tell you that I got invited to uh, present Blink 182's uh, million subs reward <laughs> plaque yeah. thing to them? That was a that, bizarre invitation. Yeah, like they wanted me to drive all the way to New York, and they were like, "Oh, well, you get to meet the band." And I'm like, "I'm not driving to New York to meet Tom DeLonge." <laughs> <laughs> Actually, no, he's not even in the band anymore. I don't give a shit. <laughs> I would I would drive to New York to meet Travis Barker and I hate Travis Barker, so I don't care. So there you have it. There you go. I guess Green Day. Who, who would you drive to New York for? Let's point out that you don't actually live that far from New York. I don't know. I just I hate New York. 
I don't, if you live in New York, I'm sorry, but I hate New York. <laughs> I live closer to Philly. So, uh, who would I drive to New York to see? I fucking, I drove to New York to audition for America's Got Talent. <laughs> Ew. Ew. <laughs> um... But who would I want to see in New York? Fucking, if I if I got to meet like if if like Bruce Springsteen called me on the phone and was like John, <laughs> I'm gonna have like a a cocaine bender with like a bunch of hookers in my luxury high rise in New York City. I would love for you to come. I would probably make that drive. <laughs> Felt like I just like I probably. Probably I'm. I would think about it. I would think about it for a long time. Yeah. John doesn't. John doesn't draft anybody. Anyway, um. Anyway, if you're on YouTube, fucking go over to the Twitch. Twitch is way cooler. Yeah, the link we'll is see in what the description. You're saying over on Twitch. Whereas on YouTube, I'm just seeing a whole bunch of Smash Mouth lyrics and confused people. And and I see Anthony on YouTube as well. Hi, Anthony. Cool. <laughs> I want to do a line on your man boob. Yeah, don't be all. Lots of people just like show bobs, show mm. tits, Maybe tits, you please. Should. Show boobs. I'm gonna get flagged. I'm gonna get flagged for showing tit. Fuck that. Yeah, you wouldn't get flagged for it. You wouldn't. Yeah. Show Bob and Vegemite. Yep. <laughs> Bob and Vegemite. Who is this Bob? Who is Bob? Yeah, who's Bob? Fucking who is Bob? And why are we showing him? That's what I want to know. Guess we'll never know. No one's going to tell us. Favorite Springsteen song. Baby, we were born to run. <laughs> do, 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 do. How long have we been going for? Um... About two hours. How long right? have we inflicted these poor people with our faces? Um, I can't see. I have no idea. <laughs> what it, what day is it? <laughs> oh goodness. Anyway, I think we are gonna call it. Mm -hmm. Um. Last time, I'm gonna say it. They've been a promise. Uh, I want to thank my whole YouTube uh, shit for watching, and uh, if you go on over to twitch.tv slash johnsedano underscore TV, we have a pretty sick Twitch channel with a really cool community, and uh, I've been paying more attention to that, honestly, more than YouTube for a bunch of reasons. But uh, <laughs> yeah, if you want to follow me over there, that'd be tight. And uh, thank you all so much for watching. And um, we had a lot of fun with this mm -hmm. stream. I had a lot of fun. Uh, thanks thanks to everyone except Anthony. <laughs> yeah. Questions. Fuck you, Anthony. Stupid um, piece of shit. I'm kidding. Man, I do stream alone. Uh, you'll find me usually streaming in my bathroom and dying. She also has her own, st her own Twitch, which is directly below mine in the description on the YouTube channel. Uh, on the YouTube video. Um, and Anthony, or yeah, if I can, Amy will put up her thingy in the description when we're done here. So, uh, yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. And uh, we appreciate y'all and we love y'all. Thank you for being part of the Thick Boy Club. And we <laughs> love y'all so much. Bye, Amy. everyone. Bye-bye.